I'm going to show you the most effective online advertising um, solution ever for any business, any small to mid-sized company, um, and it's Google PPC, uh, pay-per-click. So if you want to advertise, use Google and advertise with them. They are the best. You could test your results. You could see what's happening. You only get charged when somebody clicks on your ad and so on. And if you haven't noticed, when you go to Google and you type in something like this, you see ads up here on the top and you also see ads right here. I'm going to show you how to get up on the very top and spend less money than your competition as well in this ad. And um, as you know, if anybody tries to look for attorneys or plastic surgeons or plumbers for that matter, they're probably going to look at Google if they haven't already asked their friends on if they know somebody. So, you know, get out there on Google and everybody says Google it. That's just a, a term that everybody uses. So, you know, enough of that. Let's look at like I'm using real estate attorneys Los Angeles. Look at your competition first and see what you're up against. See if your website looks better. See if you look like you could dominate this industry of whatever it is before you go into it. And uh, I'm going to get into more analytics and research about that. But let's first talk about how you could spend less money on these ad campaigns than your competition. And the way you do it is you get very relevant. Okay, You type exactly what you do in for a keyword so you use only keywords in your campaign when you make a Google campaign for exactly what you do so notice I have in Los Angeles and that's exactly um, where I want to locate myself and attorneys in real estate attorneys so I didn't just type in attorneys so let's say I typed in just attorneys or attorney in Los Angeles that's not as relevant what's gonna happen is people are gonna start clicking on these things and maybe they're just doing a report or maybe they're just researching but it's not specific enough so it's gonna waste a lot of your money okay so you don't want to do that what you want to do is be very very specific here and also the biggest thing uh, Google has this thing called quality score quality score is basically a score they give everybody a score all these things all these ads a score and they'll give it uh, it'll be like one out of 10 or 10 out of 10 is the best score you could get and to get a quality score you'll pay less so that if this guy has a quality score of, of 2 and this guy has a, a quality score of 4 well this guy will pay less and, than this guy and he could also be higher than this guy if its quality score is higher so this guy could actually pay one dollar and this guy could actually pay four dollars and still be below them <clears throat> just because his quality score is better than his for example what you want to do is you want to say whatever the keyword is you want to say up here real estate attorney so this is really good real estate attorney in Los Angeles is even better real estate attorneys in Los Angeles on on this right here notice they highlight anything that says real estate attorneys see he just has attorneys on the second line to have a better quality score and a better you would put real estate attorneys on the second line right here for your ad as well to get a better score this is real estate fun that's not as good of a quality score it says still a set of attorneys here and it highlights everything that you put up here and that helps when people want to click on it so one of the key factors of getting a quality score is conversion if somebody is clicking on it that means that hey you are probably have a good ad so that's a good key factor of quality score and, it, and to, to get people to start clicking on it and to get your quality score higher you want your keywords to be exactly the same or pretty close to the same as your ad itself then the second thing or the third thing to have a, a really good quality score is have a great landing page don't do what these guys are doing I notice these guys are taking them to their web site but they're taking them to the home page don't do that take them to the exact exact page that you're talking about real estate attorneys that means you have to make a new ad campaign separate not just all these keywords go to here but you want to make a separate ad campaign to go to that page that uh, landing page so you want them to when they click on here to go to a page that says attorney real estate blah 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 and also you don't want it to look like this honestly this is not a good page you know this looks like a template it looks like you didn't spend a lot of money on it you know and it just doesn't really represent him yes he has his picture there I would personally get it so it's shorter up here so you could see more of the words up so 
you're seeing more of this also get a video or something show who this guy is talk about it make it look professional and so i could understand who he is you know i i'm sold by seeing who he was getting some key points and in five seconds i'm not sold or two seconds i'm not sold i'm going to move on to somebody else and i'm going to do some comparison with somebody else who may have a better site this guy again has a really bad site um it doesn't show who he is it doesn't show what they're you know, I, I, I really advocate for a lot of videos on the site just to get people entertained and interested. Not a long video, a short informational video that helps them understand who they are and, and, and some tips too. So that's really how to get the best for your buck on advertising and how to test it out and see if it works. If it doesn't work, you could stop your ad. But um, And here's how to analyze the trends in the market. You could see where... Um, this is Google uh, Google Insights, and this is how to analyze trends in the market and see what people are searching for if if it's going down or up, and uh, and it's graphed over time, and you could search by it with web uh, worldwide or United States or whatever, and you could just analyze what's going on locally, South Carolina, North Carolina, and all the demographics and see you know who's searching for what and how how much of a big search it is. Also, Google AdWords tools, you want to use this to see how much you're going to be paying for the ads and how much competition is, is on, the, on these ads and stuff. But the first thing is just type in what your, uh, your potential client would type here and look at your competition and then get an ad campaign with us or with yourself and then start these ads. That's all.